Okay, first question. Zach? Just for all three of you guys, what was working offensively to get the ball to the rim? It seemed like especially off the drive screens, actions, things like that, they just couldn't keep you away from the thing. Uh, well, we just wanted to push the ball, you know, transition, try and score in the first, you know, five, seven seconds to the ball. You know, me, Stan, Will, Evan, guys like that bring the ball up. Uh, we just kind of want to keep attacking the rim. Uh, we noticed earlier they weren't really helping off. Um, so we just wanted to try and go in the room and just finish. Ken? Will, what do you think helped the team cut down on the turnovers tonight? You only had nine. Uh, we've been working on it, like I've said, ever since uh, the season started. Uh, we work on it every single day. It's something that's just going to be constantly worked on. You know, just because we had nine tonight doesn't mean we're not going to continue working on it. Um, so really just guys committed to moving the ball, playing smart, and uh, we've been just really, really playing well lately. Dustin? Overall, just what does this game mean to you guys? I mean, to finally just end that slump you guys had against Wisconsin goes back like to 07, and, and just to get a big win like this. Um, well, you know, uh, it's something we've been look, working for all season, obviously. Um, we've had some, some uh, games where we played some top five opponents and we haven't gotten done. Um, so, you know, we knew what it, take, what it takes. Um, so really, we just continue to stick to our game plan throughout the whole time. Um, Yogi obviously made some big plays. Stan came off the bench and absolutely killed it tonight. So really, if we have guys that are committed to doing what, we're, what we've been doing, committed to the game plan, playing smart, playing hard, we're going to win games. Alex? Stan, just talk a little bit about your aggressiveness. I mean, it seemed like every time you got the ball, you were looking to kind of go to the basket, and it was there for you. Uh, well, Yogi and uh, Will, they told me uh, at the beginning of the game that the lanes were open. And they just told me to just keep going because uh, that's one of my strong points. So, uh, I mean, with two of, two of my leaders telling me to just keep going, then, you know, I felt like I had a freedom to just, you know, be me. Hector? Um, for the students, how much did the energy um, in, in, the, um, in the hall help you guys in, during the game? It was guys, uh, yeah. I mean, for, like for me, for being the first time in the semi hall, like with that atmosphere, I know that helped uh, I'm, me personally, and then the team as well. I mean, it it built it joined us together, uh, you know, down the stretch. Because I mean, I, I'm sure everybody was tired, and uh, just hearing that crowd just, you know, pre like just go crazy like that. I know I I, I I had a lot of energy. I was I wasn't tired after that one. Jeff, you know, what does the performance and the win say about how far you guys have come with the young team? What does it say about what you guys might be able to do in the Big Ten? Uh, we've, you know, come very far. Uh, we had a lot of early losses, but uh, you know, I feel like we've learned from that uh, just from watching film. And uh, you know, we're we're, we're going to take this win. Uh, we're going to be grateful for it. Uh, uh, we've been working hard in practice, but uh, we're not going to be content with it. We're still going to, uh, you know, be in the gym and practicing because uh, we know we got some tough opponents coming up. Jack, just kind of following that, Will, what does it mean for this team, or what did this team take from Penn State and being able to close that game to what it was able to do tonight, make some big shots late and then free throws late? Yeah, obviously we have young guys, and uh, getting those those games that are very close and even the way we call it back, and uh, I think we're down 15 twice in that game, um, just the way those guys know that you can win games regardless of what the score is um, really helped us. Um, the more games that they that they have that are close like that definitely helps those guys. You know, Yogi and I have played in, in a bunch of games like that, but for the younger guys to know that <clears throat> the game's not over at a certain point really helps. Yogi, I think you've missed your first seven threes before you finally hit that eighth one. Any hesitation at all before you shot that last that one? Uh, no, not really. I kind of just gave him a jab and he kind of backed up. So, uh, you know, I felt like I was open and pulled it. Uh, I felt like most of my threes, you know, it kind of felt good. Just weren't going in. Um, so, you know, if I had to make one three, you know, I was glad it was that last one. <laughs> you know, what, what gave you the confidence to keep shooting? Because for, for most of the day, your shots weren't falling. Um, you know, I just kind of just, uh, just had, you know, aggressive mindset, really. Uh, you know, I know some of my layups weren't falling early, but, uh, you know, I wasn't going to let that get to me. Uh, I was still going to try and get to the rim and uh, put some points up on the board or kick it out. Uh, so, you know, that's just the mindset, you know, I always have. Dustin, last question. Well, you play these guys uh, a lot of times. Just how different was the dynamic, the style, the pace of this game than any other, you know, IU Wisconsin game you've been in? Um, you know, they're a very talented team. Obviously, they know what they're doing. They, they stick to their game plan as well. So, um, 
I don't think that the pace of the game was really that much different than the normal. Maybe they play a little bit faster, but I mean they really stick to their principles and, and they do what they do. And um, you know we stuck to ours today and didn't you know try to have one guy take it over or anything. And <clears throat> the way the ball moved, it's tough to beat us when it's moving like that. Anything else? Okay, thanks. Thanks a lot. Thank you.